Good morning. Good morning. Exciting news from Manichet. Drill brought to you by me, Annette Block. And as you may heard, we have a new feature in Manichet where we now can integrate email into our flows. This is a great, great workaround we can do with email. We now even more can even more can we now be omnipresent with our clients because now we are shooting them texts, emails, Facebook Messenger, and Facebook. And this email future is a great way around for broadcasting. As you uh, may recall, broadcasting, you have the 24-7 rule. But now with the email, many chat found a way to go around it and get in contact with your customers, consumers, clients now with email where you can reach them right away. But for this to happen, you need to set it up and sign up for the email future. So we are here right now in my ManyChat account and we go uh, into settings and uh, a quick tip. You need to be a pro, so pay $10 to use the email future. But not only to use the email future, the pro account is $10 a month, so you can use many, many more futures with many chat. But now go into your settings, and you see we have something called email over here, and we click this, and here we set up our email future. So we need to accept the terms of service. Uh, this is uh, set up by ManyChat. Uh, if you input your email and everything in here, it will uh, automatically assume that you are accepting the terms. So with your 500, I do have for $10, the 500 Pro account, where you get 500 emails free, it will track you the email sent and you have a limit of 5,000. So that is for the higher uh, pro accounts, paid pro accounts. But when you are starting out, $10, it's enough to use many chat. So now here you have to apply to the international spam law. So because this is emailing, remember, still we are in many chat, you can now email and you have to comply to the international spam law, which requires you that you input your mailing address and your contact information when you are emailing them. So input your company name and your mailing address, save, and that is step number one. Now, many chat set up and um, flow for your emailing, which you can get uh, at ManyChat. And uh, they put in a link for you. I will put the link into this um, video so that you can get it. And that's the flow you are getting. So you save it. I saved it already, so I don't want to save it again. And then what I always do, let me go back in my account. So I saved it already. And um, under many chat templates, so that's, that's personally to me, so that I find everything what I need with a quick. A quick tip, what I always do when I get a flow or do a flow, or if I have to go in there, I always have the original and I do have the copy. Just in case I am screwing something up, I can revert to the original or make a copy of my original and um, uh, do everything on my copy. So here you see, this is the original and I go in my copy. So because I want to make a few changes in there, which I will show you in a different email. But you see, it's very easy to set up. But also, like I said before, with the email, you have to follow certain rules. And one of the rules is you have to ask your client for permission to email them. So they set up already a great template. 
I will make a few changes, but not in this because I don't want to confuse you. So this uh, flow is created. Here you can read it. This flow is created as an example of how you can request user consent to receive your emails. You can make the text more friendly, but we highly recommend using the following algorithm. First, you ask for an email address, then you ask for confirmation of their consent. So uh, when you know we have our sellers and buyers um, qualification, we normally ask for their email and phone number. And then down the road, you can pull in this flow to the original flow and ask for permission to email them. But before we do this, I will make a few changes. I will do a different video um, so I can show you what I learned and you uh, can um, use it as well or use like it is. So, but for now, great, great example how we can be become more omnipresent because now we are using Facebook to most of the time video and stay in front in our feeds from our customer, consumer clients, however you want to call it. Then when they signed up, we are having email now, we have Facebook Messenger, we have text, we have video. So now with this email, future it's great for us to stay in contact and what it looks like and what i heard they are even maybe contemplating like in crm where we can integrate everything though so that's probably down the road but for now we are using what we got I don't want to confuse you. I'm happy about this email. I think you can sense my excitement and set it up because when I come in, I will show you the changes I learned to make. So we are staying in the flow with our consumer quick. And uh, if you have any question, we, ha we have many here to help you out. So if you need set and forget, we also have agency owners in here who are willing to help you to uh, reach your potential goals. So said enough. Thanks for watching. Watch out for the next video where I'm showing you the changes I am making to my new email flow.